Hello YouTube, this is a tutorial on how to get the Dragon Priest mask. This is Corosis, we're about to fight, and he is found at Shearpoint Creek, near all of those places. It's also near White Run and Windhold, which are one of the main cities in the game. Now, um, one of the easiest methods is getting Shadowmare, a companion that's virtually invincible, apart from when fall damage. Uh, the smart thing to do here is to lure the dragon away, but I decided not to do that. Don't know why, I'm not the smartest thing in the world. Croesus pops out of this um, little coffin, and on to the left of him there are three dragon words, the throw voice. The throw voice dragon shout allows you to basically distract the enemy to a certain point. You want to go. It, however, it doesn't work if they can see you. Corosis uses mainly fireball from his staff, um, so it's good to buy some potions of fire resistance, things like that. I believe you can get them from many alchemy shops around Skyrim. There is also a dragon with him, which is pretty easy to take down, especially at my level, because it's not a blood dragon, an elder dragon. But I assume if you are higher slash lower level, they may be different. Uh, there are many other methods you can try to do this. One of the key ones that I've seen is hiding on top of a mountain and taking pot shots at him. This, this mainly works with a bow because it allows you to sneak under and so forth, so on. The sneak skill is good for Corosis because he's as blind as a drilger. Um, I think one of the key things to do to kill Corosis for me was having the stagger perk on the mage's tree. This allows him to want to do two-handed attacks, to stagger and not attack. I was hoping that in the fire breath that the dragon was doing would also do damage to him, but it didn't. Which is something to be wary of, if you were thinking like me, trying to abuse the game. At the minute I'm looking for the dragon priest's ashes to find him, but then I realise, no, I shall go fight the dragon. You can see also staggers dragons. Um, up to a certain level, I think when you get to eight elder dragons, it's less of a chance to stagger them. Um, when the dragon lands, there is another way to kill him. You can lure the dragon priest underneath the dragon, which um, kills him. I have not had this proven, but it's on the wiki, which we'll put a link in the description to. Um, my Magicka I have on um, to keep my magicka high. I have the Archmage's robes on, which you get from doing the Mage Guild quest lines. And you also get Savras Aaron's amulets. These make destruction easy to cast and use less percent. At the minute, here, yeah, um, I don't know if this is a glitch in the game or anything, but the dragon actually leaves and my horse flies, which I thought was so funny at the time. See, Shanamer, just there, she, she actually killed the. Dragon, I didn't get the last blow on it. But I still got the soul. Now, I generally don't pick up the dragon scales or bones because they over encumber me too easily. That dragon mask I have on there is the dragon mask of Morakai, which you can get by doing the Archmega's um, quest line from the Dragon's Guild. Now, to video We're going to be doing another video of Morakai on the account which is a sneak bow skill one. Mm -hmm. For next uh, video I believe we will be doing is another Skyrim playthrough. And the Mask of Corrosis is good for um, people who enjoy to use the sneak perk, thieves and things like that because of lock picking. And um, the Staff of Fireballs is, was particularly good for me because of the area of damage. 60 damage over 15 foot radius. You don't have to use magic to though, and but the charges are limited. Um, one of the key, I'm going to show you what it looks like to be wearing. One of the key glitches is if you wear the Archmage's robes whilst wearing the on one of the masks, your face disappears, which we will show you in a minute. That's what you look like with the mask on, with some other robes on. However, when you swap to the Archmage's robes, which you'll see in a second.
as I said when you swap to the Archmage's robes your face will disappear I'm really bad with the inventory I always look down instead of up there you go your face disappears However, an easy way to fix this is by saving and then reloading um, I believe that's everything for this video come back next time for more Skyrim tutorials I'll just cut it out.